Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. I'm starting from the sanctuary here because it's closest to where I want to go first. <laughs> There's a thing back over at the witch's place that you get if you give her the mushroom. Yeah, I was kind of fooling you about that a little bit earlier. <laughs> it's, it's, it, isn't, it isn't a potion. It isn't a potion, no, 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 it's something else, and that's something else I would like to grab now just because, and that guy was following me to the ends of the earth. <laughs> that's okay though, I guess. If he wants to, it's, it's up to him. Alright, so here we go, she's stirring like mad here. <laughs> Thank you, young man, come back to the shop. What? It's not ready yet? Really? Or do I have to actually get it inside here? Oh, it's inside of here, okay, I forgot about that. <laughs> It's magic powder, and we can actually use this right away outside. Uh-huh, <laughs> thank you very much. So what I'm going to use this for to demonstrate this is on this buzz blob here. Like normally, as I said before, if you swing your sword at it, ah! that's why they're called buzz blobs. They are electrified. So I'm going to sprinkle a little powder on that, and I can actually talk to them now. <laughs> it's like they give you little hints about stuff, but they still hurt you. <laughs> Um, yeah, they aren't actually a buzz blob anymore. You transform them with the magic powder. They're known as Kook Man now. Yeah, C U K E M A N, if I'm not mistaken, is the spelling. So, yeah. <laughs> and you can do that to other critters in the game, but those are the only ones that talk to you, if I'm not mistaken. Hey, 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 stop. Nope, nope. Stop it. Nope. Oh! I'm trying to get me from both sides here. <laughs> that is alright, I guess. They, they were unsuccessful in the end, and that's all that matters. Alright, now that I got Pegasus boots, I can really zoom through the overworld like nobody's business. Whee, look at me go! And I'm gonna go up here, I think, to show you a little something-something. Um, first, uh, well actually, yeah, I can do this now. Uh, I can break these things with the Pegasus boots! Look at that, look at that! <laughs> and they sometimes conceal things underneath them. And what does this contain? A harpy! <laughs> so, yes! Isn't it nice to have new accessories? I knew you'd be happy with that. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna go up here now. And uh, what do you have to say here? It's carefully. Oh, 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 talk to him without. Okay, yeah, you say the same. Yeah, they're just hint guys, basically. And uh, that rock over that you see in front of the cave, that is for later. Stop that crow, please. Please. Do, do not enter Death Mountain without King's permission. Uh, how do I get to King's permission if the king isn't there? Yeah, whatever. I hear the, these elf-looking guys here. Yo, Link, a mysterious fog has recently fallen over the forest. We have to be careful. Maybe it's nothing, but this tree feels kind of strange as we cut it. Remember this for later. Remember this. Remember, remember. <laughs> uh, over here is something you can't get right now. Keep that in mind. Heart piece. Yep, on top of the ledge. You get that from another way. Right now, we can't do anything about that. We gotta go back here after Dungeon Four in order to get that. And this is the uh, uh, the place of those two guys. And who are those two guys' names? Well, we're gonna see right here. The House of Lumberjacks. A bumpkin and B bumpkin. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Anyway, now I've gotten a heart piece and showed you around here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Stop, 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 stop. Stop. Bad. I'll take that actually because he's a little magic powder. <laughs> yeah, the magic powder uses magic power to power it. It's, yeah. <laughs> and I'm just going to avoid you. And, uh, just, I wanted to stay as far away as, they, as I could and cut the bushes there so they wouldn't come after me, but no, nah, they still came after me. What I want to do here is now go south. Remember that library that I said we'd be back to later on? Well, that's what we're going back to because this is what we need to make progress forward. Whoop. And I'm also going to be taking that other way around down south of here that I said that I was going to take a little bit later. Like, uh, remember those Pegasus boots? We can rock the world now! <laughs> and get the Book of Medora, which is basically a translation book. So, yeah. 
anyway, as I was saying, uh, south of here, remember there was that path that I uh, went to via a transition screen, and I was like, nah, I'll, I'll do this a little bit later. I'll, I'll do a little bit of explore, exploration of this right now. Uh, this right here, remember this little turnabout sort of thing here? Yeah, wow, you got good vision there, man. Oh, whoa, I missed. <laughs> Never miss against the soldiers. Otherwise, they might go inside you and then poke you to death. And right up here, you got something rather peculiar going on here. That's kind of spooky. But again, there's nothing we can do about this right now. <laughs> right now. But remember this for later. Remember it for later. Okay, I I'm not going to bother you since you didn't see me. <laughs> uh, this is... Otherwise, sort of a dead end, sort of kind of place here, in a way. Um, yeah, <laughs> at least with our current abilities. So whoa, 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 whoa. So yeah, it's just a little roundabout thing that I thought it would take as long as I was over by the library by uh, necessity. Uh, what I what I really want to do is go through here. Where is through here? Well, this is recognize it. Yep, it's Link's house, and I'm gonna use this pathway here to go into some new lands and oh 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 by the way there's uh these bunnies that are hopping out of the grass here they're no the name topo but I, I you can do something with them and get something out of them if i'm not mistaken but i forgot how to do that i think it's something like you cut the grass all around them and you pick them up out of the grass or something like that i'm gonna have to try that really quick so there's a there's a fairy fountain in there, but anyway, let's try the the topo tricko. <laughs> if it's really a trick, because it's clearly programmed in the, by the game designers. Okay, let's cut the grass. Okay, there's one right there, all around the <laughs> topo. Ow! Don't do that, please. Don't. Ah. Yeah. Ha ha. Ha. And now I'm gonna lift. No, no, no. I said lift, lift. Can I lift? Uh. Hmm. Lift, lift, lift. Happy, happy, lift. <laughs> Maybe if I cut the grass. No, if I cut the grass, they'll disappear from the spot. What if I. Oh, wait, wait. Hold on a sec. Maybe it's when they're jumping out, you strand them out of the grass. Oh, no, that's not it. Oh, there we go! Alright, take a thief! And he gives you something. <laughs> Yeah, you can get stuff from those, but it's an awful lot of effort to get something out of those guys for obvious reasons. <laughs> but not a lot of people know about that. By the way, you can also mass cut grass here with your uh, Pegasus boots if you would like to, as well as mass explore things really quickly, which is what I would like to do here. All the stuff that I'm showing right now, pretty much stuff for later, except for... except for... This right over here. I'm gonna uh, leave this section um, down this, I guess you can say, cliff a little bit later. Uh, but this is what I'm talking about that I can do right now. The first thing is uh, this block puzzle here. And it's not really much of a puzzle, except that you realize, oh no, I can get the chest, but I can't get to the door behind it. So what do I do? I gotta actually leave, and then I gotta go back to reset the blocks. It's kind of silly. So you can only get one or the other per round. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so we come in here, and then we pull on one of these. One of these has the thing that I'm looking for. Oh, that's not it. The The other one drops bombs. <laughs> it's not really all that threatening, but yeah. Oh, oh, another thing that I can do with the magic pow powder here. I'll show you that while I'm here. Uh, sprinkle it on the anti-fairies, and they'll turn into fairies. Except you... It kind of went too fast for you to see there. <laughs> oh, it's gone. <laughs> but yeah, that's, that's what it happens. Alright, so what did that do? I drained out the water outside, and that made this heart piece <laughs> just come out of nowhere. <laughs> well, it was it was submerged, but yeah. Um, this way, Desert of Mystery. This is where I would like to go next. The Deserts of Mystery. By the way, don't take the lower route. It's, it's always slower than that route. <laughs> I like this right here. Pay no attention to the average middle-aged man standing by the sign. Okay. Leave him alone. Alright, but I will pick up the sign. Oh! Why did you take my sign? It's as plain as they leave me alone, sheesh. Well, um, let's lose him. Because we can't, <laughs> we can't do anything with him right now. I just wanted to show you that for now. For later, once again, 
Yep, something for later. Once again, so many, so many things for later. This this overworld is just loaded with stuff. Woo! All right, we're good. Even though we didn't really need that. <laughs> and now we can go over to the actual desert of mystery. Here we are. Don't touch the cacti or cactuses. Aha! You may attack the vultures though, even though they don't, they don't really do much to you, they just kind of kind of roam around you. I mean, they can do damage to you, but it's not all that often they do. <laughs> this is a mine, by the way. Come on, I touched that. What? Come on now. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I wanted to set it off to show you that it is indeed a mine and not a rock or something. Um, in this cave, I believe there is something to bomb south. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Oh, oh, oh. I'm going to talk to you while that bomb's exploding. Aha. It is the Book of Medora. With it, you can read the language of the Hylia people. Uh, if you don't have the Book of Medora from the library yet, you'll be able to get a hint from him uh, as uh, as to about that. But anyway, I want to come in here really for this piece of hearts. You have another heart piece run, I guess you could say, of a uh, of video part. The the heart pieces will be, become a lot more scarce and uh, a lot more, you know, spread out through the parts as we go later on. But right now I'm just getting all of the pieces that I can get, like right now with the abilities that we have. Hey, don't, don't, don't you dare. <laughs> and but, by the way, yeah, there's those guys that pop up in the deserts. They're known as Goldman. Or something. Like, by the way, uh, this right here looks like some sort of oct octopus type thing or whatever. I don't know. But anyway, yeah, those gold men—they kind of appear under you sometimes. You gotta watch out for the the shuffle of the sand under. See, like like the eyes there, and yeah. So always be wary of the gold man. That heart piece I'll be able to get relatively shortly, but not right now. Stop that! Stop that, please. I beg of you. You're just you're just taking up screen space here. <laughs> You're just embarrassing yourself. Uh, this is where I need the Book of Medora, uh, Book of Medora, by the way. But I just want to go and uh, show you this right up here, and that is pretty much it. <laughs> uh, so when we approach the tablet in the center and chat with it, I guess you can call it. Yeah, we got this gibberish-looking thing. Well, that's actually a language, and that language can be translated with the Book of Medora. But, oh yeah, right. I got to press Y <laughs> to open the way. They'll open the way to go forward, make your wish here, and it will be granted. Oh! <laughs> this is so... <laughs> I don't know why, this just seems so weird. <laughs> and then, these rather sinister looking turtle-like rocks move, and you can make progress forward. And where will that progress forward be? Well... It's this place right here, the next dungeon, of which I'm going to do in the next part. I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you then.